Now, what could that be in reference to? I wonder. Hopefully, it's the ghosts of the people. <laughs> on the Ulysses? Uh, yeah, on the Ulysses telling Gray that it's not his fault that they, they all died. Even though it totally is. Yeah, well, I mean, they're ghosts. <laughs> Accusing the living of things is kind of what they do. <laughs> that's... That's their job. <laughs> do you watch Community? I do not. So there's a scene where um, this guy's in a theater and uh, he performs for this theater and he comes out and, the, and he's... This janitor's like, what were you doing in there? You're not supposed to be there. And he's like, uh, I just performed for that audience in there. And he's like, and the janitor's like, there's no audience in there. Nobody's been in that theater for 50 years, not since the fire. Okay, now, just mention that Trishka apparently was helped, um, helped, uh, like, helped, uh, design this unit we're fighting. Heavy Echo. Oh, oh, so these are like the, uh, armored with guys. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we are, we are aboard, we are aboard Serrano's, uh, jump ship now. Right. Fighting our way through his personal forces. Oh man. So do they have whips too? I don't think so. No. Why would you? Well, these are well. Imagine the it's the it's uh final echo that has the whips. I see. And they all died on the planet except for Trish. There we go. That bouncy ball. Although, uh, spoiler alert, actually, small spoiler alert, we will see a whip in action that is not Grace. Nice. I am not good with that, with the, with the ball. Oh, down I go. Yeah, those those guys with like the high power sniper rifles, they're they are not to be trifled with. Big door. Thanks for that. Final echo over rec codes for all Confederate tech. Front deck will see it. Right. So we hurry. Stay hidden. Oh yeah, that's um we, in case we missed that, you missed that last time. She mentioned uh, Trishka. We're able to get we're able to get in here because she has because of her ID. Well, she is she was one of Serrano's elite personal soldiers until like an hour ago. That's true. What did she Didn't have help do. What? What has she not helped do? Um, and world hunger, I guess. I suppose. But no, she's quite the prodigy, yeah. Actually, also, it is nowhere even alluded to in the game, except aside from her surname, perhaps, but apparently her canonical hometown is Warsaw, Poland. Interesting. It was in, like, like, it's on, like, the website, like, you know, character profiles or whatever. If I remember correctly. Hmm. <laughs> oh. I always like when you can reduce a guy to a charred, burning skeleton that has not yet fallen over. Little thing. Discharged is for, I believe, killing a guy like while he's charging up his uh, his charge shot like that. Hmm. I'm not sure. 
why these live wires are dangling around. I mean, this isn't the. I mean, this isn't the, the Ulysses anymore. This is not a ship that crashed. It makes it more dramatic. Once again, I try. I try to use the uh, the uh, the bouncing the bouncer weapon without a whole lot of success. Hmm. There we go. Well, I'm sure you get it eventually. Not in this playthrough. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure what all that juice coming out of him is. I mean, it's not blood. Hmm. And it's that really unwholesome yellowish green shade that. Yeah, who knows? fails, just thumper the whole place down. It's the right thing to do. Yeah, very, this close to the end, there's really no point in saving money at all. <laughs> So you can't use the money for anything else, huh? No. No, there's no... There's no gift shop you get to stop at or anything. What a shame. And... Murder efficiency. I like it. <laughs> The, the skill shot for launching a guy out the uh, side of the ship is ejaculated, by the way. Imagine what working what working for that guy on a daily basis would be like. Sexual harassment lawsuit. Well, that would go without saying, I think. <laughs> Got myself a gun, and I'm violently fiddling with my balls in anticipation of your arrival. Echo Co. 
code demands she take revenge on her own. Echo code my ass. Girls mired in bloodlust. My God. They don't really explain what they're referring to with that. Echo code demands she take revenge on her own. Yeah, I don't know. And I don't. I, I don't. Maybe it's, it might be a thing like if. Like if a fellow, like if a fellow dead Echo member, like if a fellow uh, Echo member, like you know, does something wrong, the other Echo guys have to take him down. Maybe that's the best I can guess. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, they're down. They got me. Ah, oh, jeez. All right, let's give this another try. She has made her choice. Focus on the problem at hand. So wait, they're calling you pirate? I think so. Well, that is kind of what we what we were in the eyes of the law. Yeah, I suppose. I mean, they mentioned it's something like attacking some like Confederate freighter at one point. Probably for supplies. Presumably. Or booze. Like I said. Oh, like I said. I guess. Supplies. I guess if you're grace. I guess if you're grace, that falls under supplies, basically. These are like the only time you're fighting enemies whose like words are actually understandable too. And normally it sounds like you know Jabba the Hutt is yelling at you or something. <laughs> that weird juice that comes out of him almost makes it makes makes it seem like you're killing insects or something. Maybe it's robot blood. Could be. Such language. I was referring to all the weird fluids flying around, but... Yeah, I know. You'd think you'd be kind of desensitized to bad language after this far into Let's Play Bulletstorm. <laughs> or just... Ugh. Or this... Or that, for matter, just this far into being on Pointless Side Quest. It's true. Oh... That's the end of that one.